Hey everybody, it's Forgo here. Today we're playing on Megaduck server. It just got updated today. And what I wanted to do today was I started a brand new character. I uh, set his stats, logged him in, and I leveled him to 50 with slash give XP. So you just type slash give XP and you instantly hit 50. And other than that, I have done nothing yet with his character. He's still where you spawn. He has moved. I spent my experience so you didn't have to watch me do that. But I went with uh, strength, cord, um, a little bit of focus and endurance, and a tiny bit of quickness. And then I went heavy weapon, melee, magic, because um, actually creatures do cast magic at you now. And then I wanted item magic, mana, and life, so I can actually buff myself. Um, currently, item magic doesn't have others, but some selfs are in. So what I wanted to do today was go through, uh, great, I made a character, I logged in, I hit level 50, what am I going to do now? What I would like to do is see if we can get an Atlan weapon. So we're going to try and kill some golems, get some moats, put them together, make ourselves an Atlan. So the first thing we'll do is head in here. And I'm going to pick up a wand and some basic scarabs. Um, the scarabs are so that tank can do the buffing for me because I don't feel like it. I'm just going to go ahead and get all the way to level 4s. And I will get a basic wand. And then we'll go ahead and head over to the old armorer fella. And we will go ahead and let's do or heavy weapons. So we'll go ahead and get um oh, is it chain mail or scale? I thought it was scale mail was better. I don't know. Uh do we have a heavy weapon in here? Should be yeah, a semi semi or semi, I don't know. I've always called it a semi. And Let's ignore the armor for now. We will go down here and get some of our item magic level twos. So we can buff ourselves a little bit. Should be this guy's level twos, right? Yep, level twos. And it should be just uh I think we just run down the row here. We'll get all these. I think we got frost, didn't we do catch it? Yeah, frost. Then we got frost lure, we got heart seeker, might be void, should be impen, lead weapon, lockpick, swift killer, mythic link, turn blade, should be weak and lock, alright. And we'll just bust through and read all these real quick. We'll turn off items so it stops popping that up real quick. Okay. Perfect. The um, town criers don't buff you up with item because there are no item others yet. That's, I don't know if I mentioned that, but that's where we got to grab these real quick. So we'll go ahead and learn all these guys. <coughs> Excuse me. And should be one more second here. And we'll just go ahead and start off with twos, that's good enough. I think we should be able to take out some uh, stuff with that. And what I don't remember is the best place for fighting golems, so let's pull open mm, look at some golems real quick and see. We need, like, mud golems or something easy. Okay, so mud golems look like they spawn all the way over here from Yanchi up-ish. Um, what we should do? <laughs> we'll kill a rabbit and get a hide. Oh, by the way, uh, corpses now work. I don't know if I guess saw my last video, but it doesn't throw it on the ground anymore out of spite. So we should be good. And um, I think uh, stacking should work too. I think if we stack these, yeah, there's two there. Now I'm not sure if we give if that works correctly. And then we'll talk to a town crier. That's a buff. We'll tell that town Lytle Thorpe. Then we'll go. Let's go ahead and separate these. I'm kind of. I actually don't... I don't know if I can separate them, so we might have to kill another rabbit. Whatever. I probably shouldn't have joined those. I know for, um, like, drinking potions and stuff, it doesn't use all of them. 
but I don't know if handing it in if he'll take both. He'll probably just take them both, if I had to guess. Hopefully there's a uh, rabbit around here. Should be just down the hill there. Black rabbit, yep. So let's see what he does first. I think he's going to take them both. Yeah, he took them both. That's right. We will take our bunny slipper elsewhere, mister. We will kill this bunny. Okay. And we'll make some bunny slippers. Boom. We got some bunny slippers. Alright, so now let's go ahead and we will... Uh, don't care about that. Let's make sure... Advanced, 25, and buffing, spell access, dish, dish, dish. that was 25, should be fine, I don't care about a gold scare of you dingo, we'll add a wand, and a semi, and on, it should swap, yeah, so the problem was I didn't have my, um, I want equipped. Alright, so let's turn off everything else. Take some item and we'll put. I guess we'll put it here. Acid Bane. We'll put the um, weapons here. Blood Drinker Defender. Heart Seeker. Blink. Swift Killer. We'll get two for the Banes. Blood Loather? I don't remember. I think Blood Loather's bad, isn't it? Uh, I don't remember. There's another flame bane. Frostbane. Mystic void sounds bad for sure. Lead weapon's bad. Things not to cast on yourself, right? Bane on my armor. Okay, so now should be fine, right? That happened with bunny slips? I don't remember. It's putting it on me. That's why I went Man of Sea, by the way, with some um, life magic. Because I didn't want to have to do this in, for an hour and a half trying to get all that crap. Alright, perfect. Now if we turn combat on, we should be able to run up to this chicken. Swap to it and fight. Perfect. And he should have a chicken hat. Very cool. Okay, so tank works for melee. Um... <clears throat> looting works for corpses, all that kind of stuff. So what we're going to do is we're going to just go, I think, just run north from here. We should start seeing, because right between Yancey, Lattlethorpe, that kind of stuff, out in the woods here. So we're just going to head this way, and we're just going to start looking for um, some golems, and we'll see how it goes. So this is our adventure. We're on the road again. On the road again. Now, hopefully it's not too too much of a big deal to try and find some golems, because that's going to be annoying if it's difficult to find them. Uh, we might find a dungeon that has some or something, because respawns are in. Um, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll search for that while we're running. Dungeons. That's a chicken, that's a chicken. Looks like the crystal mine. Um... I wonder if... Let's kill a dredge prowler. I bet you we can get a dredge mask. Let's just turn combat on. Yep, there's a dredge mask. Actually, the letters and the necklace work too, by the way. Oh, I read that. I thought that said toilet Ursuin. I'm dying. I'm dying inside. Using the corpse of the dredge prowler. Why is it using the corpse judge plow? I don't have looting on. A couple of shreds and an Urswin. 
So yeah, I mean, this is one of the things, you know, when you get on, the first thing you should do is just come in here and start wanking on stuff. Um, the other thing, too, um, healing kits work in the game. I never tried adding them to tank and seeing if it will try and heal me with healing kits, actually. So... I don't actually know about that. Little green seeds. Oh, we can get a urson hide. Uh, something. Rat tail. Don't care about that. I don't know if you noticed the corpse despawn. Did you see that? Pretty nice, right? Reed sharks. These probably drop a hide. Tell you what, we can uh, get these. Oh, look, there's a golem. See? Told you they were close. Hey. Hey. Uh, tank does appears to be using full power every time. Yep, there's a hide. I think that's a setting in advanced. Melee. Uh, auto attack power, false. Use what I told you. <clears throat> Mud Golem Sludge Lord. Ooh. Ooh, he's a big boy. Let's go, Sludge Lord. You got nothing on me, Sludge Lord. I think. Yeah, there we go. That should be going fast. Perfect. You notice it did do less damage when it went fast. Somebody was saying earlier that slash pierce is the same, no matter piercing or slashing, but it actually does less, so. At least attack power seems to matter. We'll go ahead and switch. Yeah, let's do it a lot more. Oh, we cast a spell, but we resisted it. Look at us go. Um, and we got another. T so we got a towel. I think you turned that into an Age of the Arcanum. I don't know. Let's go. We can turn a couple of these things in. I think that'd be cool. I think one of them's like a muddy towel. I don't know. Let's see. We got another Ursman hide. Same one. Small Ursman hide. Yeah. There's a uh, Gromney over here. I thought I saw. Is that it? Yeah, there he is. Azure Gromney. I think they drop hides too. It's a recharge hide. We should get a Gromney hide. Gromney hide and a tooth. Um, let's go to Calabar real quick and we'll turn some of these in. I did get one moat so far. Haha. -ha. <laughs> so, I, in fact, what I think uh, what I think I'll do too, we'll turn a couple of these things into the um, leather crafter, but then I will go do some hunting for the moats on my own, and then see. Kind of, uh, look, gloves, that's good. What do you got? Pants, good. What do you give me? A butt? Nice. Always a butt? Yes, always a butt. Uh, ivory crafter, I think you turned this guy into, which I think is over here somewhere. That's a trophy smith. Kind of feel like that's not who's going to help me. Let's see what he says. Doesn't know what to do that. Yeah, uh, there's an ivory somewhere. There's the scrivener. It's a stone collector. I feel like there's an barkeep. Uh, we can try the agent to the Arcanum to the, the towel and see if we get the muddy towel too. Or the clean dry towel or whatever. Uh, no. Oh, you know what? It's in Yark. Is it one of these guys? Uh, no. What? I thought he was. Archmage, Grocer, Tailor, let's load the craft we just at. I don't know, let's go um, <clears throat> to Yark and we'll turn in the towel. And we can turn in these guys to the collector. Um, I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of people PKing. Inside of here, there's the collector as well as the lady that takes the towel, I think. Is that right? You take the towel. I gave it to myself. Lol. Yeah, see, there you go. Mara Luke gives you those. And then I look fancy. And then the collector will take this thing and give me XP. 500 XP, great. 1000 XP and. Hello? There we go. 1500. I don't think you take the tooth, right? No, you don't care about the tooth. I'm going to drop this on the ground because it doesn't do anything right now. 
And we can drop a bunch of these down. Oh, there's a, there's a clean dry towel on the floor right there. Funny. Alright, so we'll put this on and this on. And we'll tell the town East Ham. And we'll turn in the drudge head. We'll get a drudge head. So then we'll be we'll have everything but upper body. That'd be cool. Yeah, they're terrible, but still funny. And we earned them. We tried hard to get these. Makes us unique, you know? <laughs> so we'll turn this stuff in and then I'm I'm gonna I'll stop the video for a minute and I'll you guys will come back in. Look at me go. Look at me go. Uh next time you see me I shall have um a bunch more moats. Ivorycraft. I knew there was one somewhere close by. Oof. Let's try giving him the tooth. I don't know. I don't even remember what this thing does. Or even if you're supposed to give it to an Ivorycraft. It just sounded good on paper. Azure Tooth Atlatl Dart. Is that even what? First of all... <laughs> what? First of all, mi missile weapons aren't in the game yet. So we're working on that. It's coming up. P's working hard on a bunch of different stuff. I know um, stability and portaling and all kinds of cool stuff is coming up, so I will throw this on the floor. That's useless, but that is funny. I didn't even know that was a thing. Azure Tooth at Laddle Darts. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. We're going to pause it here for now. I will see you when I have some more moats. Okay. Alright, we're back. So, crazy, crazy stuff happened. I <laughs> I did the whole dang thing and you guys weren't with me. I did not hit record because I'm a dingo. So, I do have an atlas sword, but I got another ingot. We're going to do it again. So um, I did go hunting for a long time. I got a bunch of different things. I got some Verindi mask. I got some uh, clothes and that kind of stuff. Uh, I killed a couple of I killed a fragment. It dropped all the shards. This is for GSA later on. I got a few pieces to go towards the GSA um, so we can start doing some of that so we can make the uh, crystal frag. Um, all that kind of stuff. So we got to get going on that. Um, but we're ready to, to uh, we'll, I'll finish up the, um, I'll refinish up the Asperian uh, weapon quest. So one, one thing we need to do is go in here. Let's see. Um, we need to go in here first and get the empty decanter essence. Now, the first time I ran through here, I had like 12 health left when I was done. It was actually like a close one so we're gonna I'm just gonna crush through this thing real quick I don't really know my way but I'm just gonna run anyways um, and there are dudes with quiddity weapons in here too I don't know what that's about but there appears to be a bunch of them let's see I need to keep going this way I think nope I feel like I went the wrong way to begin with Hello? I don't know where to begin with. Am I just an idiot? Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Yeah, no, that's definitely wrong. Caught in a slide. I feel like... Okay, this is a door. Can we go down here? What's in here? Nothing. It's empty. What's in here? Is there a door here? Is that empty? Hello? Empty room? Yes, perfect. <laughs> perfect. Where am I going? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Alright, so, yeah, I'm 100% lost. Good. Perfect. Great, grand, wonderful. Okay, so clearly that was the wrong door. Let's go. Let's try this one. Oh. Uh -huh. I don't know where the crap I'm going. I'm just going... Feel like this way maybe oh this looks like stuff's happening yeah there we go decanter essence teletown yark okay so we got that now we need to go to the fathomless abyss now this one is was not too great either there were a couple dread maddies yep they're back so they respawned so we get a couple more paws i feel like that'll be cool so we'll have four paws because yeah last time i got two of them Two shot him. This sword, oh, by the way, this sword, way stinking nicer than the Simi. Okay, so we'll pick these two up. I think these are the ones you turn in and you get the uh, Matakar claw thing, the weapon. I think that's what it is. 
You'd think I'd know how to run this quest now that I just did it like two minutes ago, but good luck to me. Um, my people graduated with me? What am I reading in chat? <laughs> All right, so this one, really, you just got to find your way down a bunch. If you can go down, you're going the right way. And I don't recall... Oh, no, this is the one... Oh, duh. No, 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 I'm dumb. This is where you teleport to go down. So I went the wrong way to begin with. I forgot about this. Uh, no, this is wrong. Let me get back to that big room. Where big room? Where you at? Yeah, there you go. All right, so you go this way, and then left. Sorry. So from the drop, take a right down, and then left, and it should be yellow. And it's uh, 50 to 59. So, all right. Now, sorry about that. You're gonna go down every time, and you gotta jump, and then you're just gonna use this on the portal. And the falls. Uh, I have enough jump, apparently it doesn't hurt me, so whatever. I'm going to keep going. I'm not even going to bother with these things, but they do kind of hurt, so I don't rightly remember. Last time I kind of, yeah, see, this is wrong. It's just, I just ran around blindly until I found like a spot where you could jump off, so I'm going to do the same thing this time, uh, and also I'm going to verify that I am recording. Yes, I am recording. <laughs> I won't do that twice, because that was stupid. Um, I need to go to, uh, yeah, down there. Is it down here? No, nope, that's just a dead end. There was a down that had a jump to it. Somewhere. That's a loop again. Back up. So, again, this is what I did last time. I just ran around. Finally, I'll find a jump part. That's where I dropped down. So then you take a... Left was not the right way at all. Okay, yeah, this looks good. I remember that. Alright, so for the drop, take a right. Perfect, there's a jump. And then... Around. This way. At least they're not hitting me, because... Poof, there's a lot of them. They're buffing the crap out of me, too. I did do a lot of melee and magic D. Um, could I go... Right there? Yeah. Jump. I almost missed that. Perfect, there's the floaty stuff. Go here, town, crater, village. You know, and again, we've got the cheaty method, but I think that uh, we just finished again. So we'll do this onto that bad boy. Oh. Intravescence. I want to ink it. Oh. Fix busy. Is that right? Oh! Ooh, I'm dumb. Uh, I forgot. Uh, Tele town. Four. We don't use it on the ingot. We're not done. You use it on a diamond uh, powder and then use that. Oh, what did I afford? I need to go to Teth. Um, that was stupid. Uh, so we're at Fort Teth now, and we're looking for a diamond golem, which last time there was one kind of down the hill. Yeah, see, I killed this thing last time. And then it was down around the corner. Crystal Shard was what dropped all the um, shards for this thing. So, Crystal Shard's there. There's a bandling. Come down this way a little bit. And it was off to the side over here. I'm going to run around these bandlings if I can. Oh, there's a lifestyle. And I remember they were like over this way. So, we're going to we're just run around and see if we can find one. They were in this um, sandy color. Actually, what do you want to bet my corpse is still sitting over here? That'd be funny, right? Look at these Ulthoi. Um, don't want Ulthoi. No, thank you, Ulthoi. Banderlings again. You see... What was that? Bones spawn in the air? Another... Crystal Frag, I think. Is it Got Rock Extus Raider? And a Crystal Shard. Let's go around them. Yeah, they were somewhere over this way. Um, I'm kind of nervous being around here because this stuff's pretty sketchy. It's like level 100. Yeah, I feel like I was right over here. Gold Golem. Bunch more Ulthoi again. Um. 
I'm not even reading chat. If anything fun's going on there, let me know. <laughs> I am not on as Thorgal, by the way. Thorgal instantly gets a billion texts, so I have I am past where I can just log in as me. Right now I'm Duncan McLeod. Uh, a cynic diamond gold. You know, I don't know if he's dropped the powder. Let's see. He's 105. I don't know if I can hit him. We're sure gonna try. This was the this was the problem is the, the, the diamond golems are hard to hit. Man. I don't have any real three levels not high enough and they hurt. All right, I hit him for sixty seven. He's got a lot of health. The problem is the wars. We can evade them all day. Is this our buddy? Is this our buddy? Oh, that's odd, Tama. We got a couple people. We got like 10. Forever odds kill. So he's got his army running. That's cool. Um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> and then he. Thanks. <laughs> he's giving me ultra armor. That's a little better than what we got. Should we still rock the bunny slippers? <laughs> and we'll use a uh, decanter on the diamond powder. And this now. Thick diamond oil on this bad boy. Hello town crater village. What do you find me? Blade of the Fallen. Nice. Hmm. <laughs> so, he's just saying that the, this is one of the better weapons that you can actually get right now. Um, and the weapon type and damage are wrong. They're the old school um, slash pierce. So it doesn't quite work the way it should, and the cantrips don't work and things like that. But it'll work for me. I'm heavy weapons, so um, Tilltown Crater Village. All right, so we'll go turn this in, and we'll have completed... Uh, technically twice, the <laughs> the dang uh, Hesperia weapon quest, the Allens. So, I don't know. Should we get another sword? I don't know. What else is heavy weapons? I don't even know. Uh, I don't think any of the other ones are heavy. We can do an Asperian wand. That'd be cool. We'll do a wand and a sword. Put the that. Boop. And then we can give that to him. Boom. And we'll get rid of this dingo wand. And now we'll fix tank to have a fallen sword and now we got a Hesperian wand so that worked out so we got a wand and a uh, sword that's awesome um, thanks to everybody who uh, popped in and helped me that was awesome appreciate it and uh, until next time it's been Thorgo it's been uh, Mega Duck some fat AC playing some Asheron's Call again actually doing quests having fun interacting with people people help me out man it's awesome so uh, until next time, bye.